Hey everybody, my name is Sarah and I'm a budgeting mom of girls. On this channel, we use a zero-based budgeting method, cash stuffing, and savings challenges to get our family out of debt and achieve financial freedom. If this is something that interests you, I would love for you to join us on our journey. Hello guys, welcome back or welcome if you're new. Today we're going to do a budget with me video. Um, we are, let me get my uh, planning sheet out here. We are going to be um, budgeting $844 this week. So let me just pull these out. Do you guys ever get sick of like the same old, same old stuff? Because <laughs> I did this week. So I made my own little like bookmarks. I don't know how well you can see it. This one says this week, so I know exactly where I have to go. Um, this one's my checkbook register one. It says checkbook register. Um, I do, every year I do this year in pixels. It just helps me with my mental state, you know? So um, this is an easy way to get to that one. And then I did this one. This is just for my regular calendar where we are in this week. Um, I thought it was super cute. It just says you are here now. Kind of a reminder of be present in the moment. And also, this is where we're at this week. So <laughs> anyway, that is that. So um, this week we have just groceries in our house, house payment coming out. So that left us with $844 to budget for the week. Um, $255 of that is going to be prop money because we're just going to automatically put Gretchen's car fund and the emergency fund into um, the uh, savings account. Um, but I still like to plan that. So um, as per usual, every week I go through and try to plan ahead um, for what I would like to put in each of the um, envelopes. And then this video is um what we're actually going to put in all of the envelopes so we let's get started guys let me zoom in real quick here all right so we are going to start with our weekly wallet and i have a surprise for you guys i again got bored so i changed some stuff up i put this dashboard in here this was in my um, savings challenges one, but I moved it to this binder and then I made all new envelopes <laughs> because all of my fonts were different. So I decided to just do all of them in this font. And so I made all new envelopes for all of my binders. So you'll see that today. Okay. So the only thing is I did glossy on all of these, so I really apologize because it's not good for filming, but man, do I like the look of that better. So, oh well. So, first thing we're going to do is take the $844 and subtract the um, prop money. So we have $589 to work with. So, in eating out, we are going to do... Oh my gosh, I did it again. This is supposed to be the opposite direction. We're going to still do the 110 in eating out. <laughs> um, drinks, where is it going to do? Sorry, you can't see that. Maybe if I prop it up, it'll be better. Is it better? Does the light hit it differently? Okay. Um, drinks, we're going to do $70. And then you can't even see this. And then oh, it's entertainment. We're going to do for $10. Let me scoot all this stuff over. I am a hot mess today, you guys. I'm sorry. Try to get this done at work, but today everybody was there, so I couldn't do it. <laughs> so I have to do it at home. Oh, goodness. All right. Uh, happy hour. We still have money in here, so we didn't go out this week. So we have 10, 20, 25. I think I'm only going to do, I initially budgeted 25. I think I'm just going to do $20. Um, and if we go out, great. If not, we'll just um, have a little extra money. Um, supplements, 
we're going to stick with the 25. That's usually what works for us. NNG, um, they're going to get $10 still. Um, Betty and Ivy are not getting anything. The next one is sports. That's also going to get $10. Um, let's see how much we have in here, actually. 10, 20, 30, 40. Yeah, I like just being ahead in it. Um, we have another game tomorrow, and then we have two games next week. So that's $30 gone right there. So it'll be nice to just put another $10 in there. Um, I'm going backwards here. Groceries, I put way back here. I'm going to stuff $5 in there because I always, the last few weeks, I feel like We've gotten our groceries and then suddenly it's like, oh my gosh, we forgot to get this. And I never have money in here, so I decided to put it in there. Um, and then Matt's also going to get five. Shh, don't tell him. Let's see how fast we can build this up before he notices it. <laughs> All right. And then I have to show you guys, I got a new binder from Budget with Grace. Let me zoom out so you can really appreciate what it looks like. It's gorgeous. It's gorgeous. It's black. This actually is what prompted me to make all new envelopes um, because I just wanted it to look nice. So this is um, was all the stuff that was in my purple binder. And I just love this dashboard in here. Um, I actually made this dashboard and I just thought, oh, it's gonna, it looks stunning in the black. So I'm super excited about this. Yay. All right. Continuing on. <laughs> oh goodness dentist is going to get $45 I think we're sticking with that yeah there's only 10 in there and we got to really bulk that up so we'll just stick with the 45 um pets is empty but we are going to actually put in $30 instead of the 15 that I initially thought because our poor cat she's still not I don't know. She's so itchy. She's got so many scabs everywhere. Um, so yeah, we probably should take her back in. Um, Advocare is not going to get stuffed this week because I had to pay myself back anyway. So I just left it in the bank account. Uh, Beauty is going to get the um, 15. Did I subtract the 30, you guys? Oh, I don't remember. Let's go through this really quick again. So we are stuffing 589. So beauty is going to get 15. All right. Birthdays um, currently has $10. We're just going to add five. Um, clothing is not getting stuffed. It has $30 still left in there. So I think I'm just going to leave it be for a little bit. Lawn care um, has 10. We'll just stick with the 10. Um, open house. Open house is going to get, we're going to go down um, to 20. Unfortunately, because I really want to get that build back up. Household is not getting stuff this week. Skincare is. I need to buy some face lotion, so I need to get that up. I hope I did that right. Car maintenance. We are actually going to put $5 in here. Co pays. Uh, none of these. None of those are going to get stuff. So that is at it in my beautiful new black binder. And then. Oops. Next up is the longer term sinking funds. Um, Gretchen's car. We're doing. Um, not two fifty. We're doing two hundred, but it's in prop money, so I'm not gonna subtract that from there. Um, and that will give her twenty seven hundred dollars in there. Um, vacation's not getting stuffed. Pest control is fully funded. Um, the city. We're gonna just put the twenty. And that's gonna get us up to eighty. Um, car registration. We're not doing that one. We are not stuffing deductible. Gretchen's senior year is getting some money. I always, I just feel like I need to stuff this every now and then. So, 
um, I'm going to start back to school for the first time. So we're going to put $5 in there. Um, and then here's a new one. New brand spanking new. I mentioned in a previous video that my husband and I um, would like to get an iPad. Um, so we are going to start saving for that. And we are going to start with $15. Um, and then I am not going to do, uh, the annual fee for AdvoCare, but I'm going to put $5 in Amazon Prime and that'll get us up to 20 bucks, which is kind of nice because we have an, a, almost a year to get that, probably about 10 months to get that stuffed up. So that's cool. And I did end up creating a pet sitter one because I thought we will go away again. So I should probably have an envelope for that. So all right. I hope I did that right. Oh my gosh, you guys. I don't normally subtract all my stuff as I go, like, on this way. So, hopefully it's right. Um, holidays this week is only going to... We weren't going to do anything, but I managed to kind of piece it together. So, I could at least put a little bit in there. So, we're going to do $15. And that's um, going to be... Five dollars in Mother's Day, Father's Day, and Fourth of July. So the next, the three that we have next, and then Christmas is not going to get stuffed. That was a tough one to not do, but we opted to not do that one um, because our goal is to pay off all the debt. So um, we have stuff in our savings challenges we need to do instead. I totally botched this up, so I'm going to quit doing that. <laughs> So let's start in this one. Oh, I created new dashboards too. I forgot to show you on the other one. So I created this new, I don't even know if you guys can see it very well. It says savings challenges on it. The little quote down here says, um, money grows on the tree of persistence and it's a Japanese proverb. So I thought that was kind of fun, but yeah. I don't know if you guys can see it or not. Anyway, so for the month of April, the monthly challenge one, we are gonna do the $25 one. And then hop back to um, pet emergency is not going to get anything this week. Emergency fund is. I'm actually going to put $55 in the emergency fund because I want to get it up past $500 and that will give us um, $550. So, um, but, oh, I forgot. That's going in the account, so I won't subtract that. <laughs> Um, and then our saving challenges. So we have $12 going to the Oopsie Daisy one from Budget with Carly. It saves $100. We have $15 going to my $15 saving scratch off from um, the Humble Budgeter. And then we have, where's my sticky note? Oh, $29 going to um, my $250 scratch off challenge from Budget with Carly. So that all totaled $56 for those savings challenges. I am going to do Freebie Friday again, so I budgeted $30 for these um, six challenges, so I'm going to film that tomorrow. I'm so excited. And then at the end of the day, um, with our budget all said and done, we were left with um, $3 that I'm going to stick in the dollar savings challenge. So that's kind of exciting. All right, let's add this all up and make sure that I really didn't screw up um, while I was planning this out. We'll see. <clears throat> oh, thank goodness. Awesome. I love it when that works out. All right, I am going to pull up, where's April? My cash planning sheet from the Aesthetic Dollar, along with a teller slip that I made. I'll fill those out really quick off screen and then I'll be right back, guys. All right, I'm finally back. I had some issues. 
so it looks terribly messy but at the end of the day it all worked out i have my teller slip filled out ready to go for tomorrow um so i'll take this to the bank tomorrow get the denominations and then i will be back um with my cash stuffing video um the next time you see this um I just want to say thank you again to everybody who has um, subscribed to my channel and followed me along on this journey. It's been an um, exciting one. Um, it's such a challenge, but it's been fun. Um, and if you are watching this and you are not subscribed to my channel, I would greatly appreciate it if you would join the crew. Um, it's free. I try to be fun. I try to be funny. I'm not always, but um, yeah, come along and let's have some fun on this budgeting journey together. All right, guys, I'll see you in my next video. Have a good day. Bye-bye.